All right, so this is the wall that we're going to leave metal in our living room. I went ahead and painted, kind of spot painted over all the rust areas. This is called a rusty metal primer. And we only had about two areas that were really rusted, but the rest I didn't even, I mean, if it had a slight bit of rust, I, I went over it. I did this also because I'm going to paint over this with a teal. And so I'm just gonna do a spot paint real quick just to um, see if I need to use a different primer on top of those letters to make sure they don't bleed through. So let me go ahead and do that spot paint. All right, so I went ahead and did a spot paint and as you can see, I can still see that C. So what I'm gonna do is, cause I don't wanna waste this paint, this is the color that I wanna go with, with this teal. I want to, I'm gonna go ahead and buy a can of either white or gray primer. And then I, I have a spray, a paint sprayer. I'm gonna spray the whole wall paint, uh, with the primer first and then I'll go back over it with this color. So I'll have to head to the store to get that. fig trees I'm gonna zoom in a little bit so you can see so the tree is loaded as you can see I don't know if you can let me zoom in a little bit if you can see them we've picked off of it for a month now I absolutely love figs, but these last ones, it's got the sun has got a glare. It's really bright out here today. Every once in a while, I can come out here and find ones that I can pick, but for the most part, they won't. They won't turn. They're just green. So I'm able to find ones here or there that are turning, but it just slowed down. So I'm going to let these ripe just a little bit longer. Sometimes it only takes a day and then I'm eating them. Thought I'd just share that with you. Let's get back to work. Remember? The leaks that I said we were having whenever it rained in our living room area on the metal um, wall where the metal and the wood meet um, I'll put another picture up on the screen but Jamal found a roof patch 
that we're going to try to see if that works. Uh, we've tried, like it said in the previous video, we've tried several different things. So he's going to try that and we're supposed to get rain in a couple of days. So let's see if that finally fixes those little drips. you could tell that he put down this mesh first and then he went back over it with the roof patch so it says that it's supposed to take 24 hours to cure so we're not supposed to have uh, rain for the next two days so we think that that's a should give it enough time so we're hoping that when it rains, we don't have any leaks. So this is the other side. He did both sides. We had one tiny little leak on this side, down here in the back, and then two on the other side. So we are going to go ahead and attempt to paint this metal wall, Alex and I. Are you gonna paint? Okay. <laughs> So I say attempt because um, I feel like we need to thin the paint out. We, um, when we were doing the primer, we felt like we probably should have um, thinned out the primer and it would have came out a little faster out of our sprayer. Uh, but um, we already finished that. So if we, we need to thin out the paint, we will. But if not, then I'm gonna go ahead and finish this wall. So Alex is gonna go at the opposite end and he's gonna just kind of play <laughs> but I'm gonna go ahead and start um, on this other end and start with the sprayer all right let's get started ready started. <laughs> doesn't look like I need a thinner or anything so I'm gonna go ahead and knock out this wall and Alex already quit on me and went outside he said he was done so he went to go swing I'll be back so I finished I think I'm gonna have to go over it one more time with a second coat just because I see some a lot of areas I was gonna say some but I see a lot of areas that need more paint so I'm gonna do a second coat but I won't be doing that right now. I am tired, hungry, and I have a little bit of a headache. Um, even with the mask, those fumes still came through. I'm glad Alex gave up and went outside. So, that's it. All right, so that's it for this video. I'm gonna go ahead and wrap up this day. Um, I'm really happy with how the wall turned out. I uh, was really excited about getting that color and we have so much more in store 
Uh, we hopefully, in our next video, we're going to get the sheetrock done in the middle section. Uh, we've been struggling really hard with working on our house because he's been really tired coming home. Uh, the new account that he's on has him working more outside. And because of this COVID-19, the other account shut down. So just stick in there with us. We haven't even made it to the kitchen yet, which is, I think will be very exciting. Yep. Um, we decided not to do the, uh, the kitchen. Um, so soon because uh, it does get hot here, hot out here where we're at. And once we open up that side, uh, there's no insulation. It's just going to let all that hot air uh, continue to cool into the rest of the house. So we're waiting probably to around October when it starts to cool down a little bit and uh, we can start getting that knocked out. So, other thing is that I'm getting ready to go out of state for a little bit. My dad, we thought he had COVID 19, but it turns out he has pneumonia, which is a good thing because. We're glad he doesn't have COVID-19. But I'm going to go home and help my mom with that and hope that he gets some work done while I'm gone. But we'll see. So, I'll get work done. <laughs> so stick in there with us. Uh, we do appreciate your support. We love the comments, so continue to do that. And uh, we appreciate all our patrons that are helping us out as well. So continue to like and subscribe, let your friends and family know, and we'll see you next time.